Ain't no other sight in the game to see the boxing boys. First and foremost, you have a tremendous fighter, Julian Williams, J-Rock, as most people know. What's going on with his career? What's he doing out in the Bay Area for like the fourth, fifth time? What is going on in his career currently? Well, first off, I'm far from a legend. I'm just getting started in the game. I've only been training for about six years now. But, you know, I'm trying to make my way. Um, Julian comes out here, kind of gives us that camp feel. He, um, he gets to kind of isolate himself and, you know, just concentrate on the boxing aspect. You know, it's a lot of recovery. It's a lot of uh, different things that we don't have access to in Philadelphia. So it's good for him. It makes him peak out good for the fights. When a lot of people have looked at the PBC landscape, they've said that there's a lot of guys out there that might not be fighting the best, but one guy that comes up is J-Rock. They're like, man, that's one guy that you can tell wants to fight the top guys. There's like Austin Trout, there's all these names, Charlos, um, K9 Bundridge. When do you think that big fight might be coming from? You know what, I get asked that question all the time, and a lot of people, a lot of fans, and a lot of media, they get a little bit frustrated because the fights that they want to see don't get made. But all I can say is, it's not on our part. You know, I'm willing, we're willing to fight. After this fight, you know, he's going to be a lot more vocal. You know, I don't believe in talking about other fights until you get the guy in front of you out of the way. But after this fight, you know, he's going to put guys in a position where if they don't fight, then it's up to the to media to call them and just pretty much say that they just don't want to fight. You know what I mean? Because... It's not up to us, you know, to, it takes two to tangle and if we accept the fight and the other guy does not accept the fight, we have to move on in a different direction. You can't just wait around and be inactive and not make money when guys don't want to fight. Is it a little frustrating that Austin Trout is fighting Joey Twinkle, Twinkle Hands or Twinkle Fingers Hernandez, the guy that J-Rock just fought? Um, it's not frustrating because Austin Trout's not the champion. On the division, you know, he's no. Actually, is what is funny is BoxRec has a um, objective rating system. You know, they don't rate on you know opinion. They just do a numbers rating. And Julian's ranked over him on BoxRec. In the ring, he's only a couple slots ahead of Julian. You know, and in the sanctioned bodies, he's only a couple slots ahead of him. Austin Trout was just the highest ranked guy that Heyman had. That's not a champion. So Julian was like, well, nobody else is calling his name. He's a tricky southpaw. I'll fight him. And he didn't want to fight. So, but it doesn't frustrate us. That's something that Austin has to explain. We've moved on. We don't fight him. We don't fight him. You know, it's no big deal. Okay. And I was. I also thought that, that fight was kind of interesting. Like the, a lot of people think, just calling him out. But it was like he also was on like something called a pay per view. Or I guess it wasn't a pay per view, but it was like a very big Showtime card. So he's like the the closest man in proximity that's been in a really big card. So it would make sense to fight him. It, it would. I mean, Austin has been on some big cards. Uh, he fought Cotto. He fought Canelo. But, I mean, if he's not interested or he thinks that, you know, Julian, the fight with Julian does not make sense or he feels like uh, that, you know, he wants to go in a different direction or he wants a bigger name, then more power to him. I wish him the best of luck in his career. But it's boxing. We're in the same division. We're handled by the same people, you know, Austin has about three or four comeback wins. I, we thought it would be a good fight, but people keep bringing their name up. But Austin Charles not the only guy that Julian wants to fight.